Hi guys, welcome to another ramble. Um, really quickly, I don't expect this video to go on too long, but some things to be aware of. Um, a, I want to say a cluttered space is a direct reflection of a confused mind. And for me, I feel like a common, I want to say, rule that I like to follow is less is best. You know, I feel like especially as we interact with this particular life, um, I don't know. I don't know how everyone else is choosing to operate, but for me, less is more. And what do I mean by that? And how am I going to tie less is more in with a cluttered space is a confused mind? Well, for me, I think if you've been watching my videos, I've been talking about like, I want to say fostering a more minimalistic lifestyle. And what I mean by minimalistic is just kind of like um, taking stock of things that don't necessarily I want to take I want to say um, taking stock of things I don't need guys <laughs> you know there's this is so funny um, I think when I was younger and I was not as aware you know, and I was looking for like distractions and things outside of myself to self-soothe, I would, I was a compulsive spender, you know, I was a compulsive consumer. And what do I mean by that? I mean, not only would I like, um, do retail therapy and spend excessive amount of my energetic monetary Uh, what am I trying to say? Money is energy, okay, guys? So I'd be like exchanging monetary energy for stuff I just did not need in order to self soothe and distract in the moment, you know? And I think you guys, if you guys have um, this addiction, you know, it is an addiction, by the way. <clears throat> you just buy things you don't need. And the next thing you know, your house is like cluttered with a bunch of stuff that you don't need. It's just taking up space, you know, and those are energetic blockages. Um, people who um, emotionally eat, I used to emotionally eat, you know, to self-soothe, to distract in the moment, to regulate myself in that moment, you know. Like I said, all of these things are external, right? Um, I would use, not necessarily, yeah, to some degree, yes, we, you know, we use people relationships to distract ourselves to self-soothe because we're unable to regulate ourselves to self-soothe ourselves to feel safe in our own bodies with ourself so you know all of these things if you if you really look at it they're all distractions and we consume these things because we want not need we want to be distracted and soothed in the moment, momentarily. But I think in the large schematic of things, like say like, I don't know, you participate in such habits and rituals and like a decade goes by or two decades go by and you look back in your life and you look at your house and you're like, oh my God, I've accumulated all this stuff, you know? Or, and it's not even like in the house, it's this is your house, you know? So like, I know a lot of people don't want to hear this, you know, I'm not body shaming or anything, but seriously, if you are, you know, over your ideal weight, <clears throat> you know, it's probably because you have like cluttered emotions that you haven't like contended with in your body. You know what I mean? Because think about it. I mean, I think you guys know, like when you are, you know, I don't know clutter clutter guys clutter in the body clutter in the home this is the primary home this is the primary vehicle you know you're like experiencing life through this body 
you know, so that's why it's so important to take care of it. <laughs> Some people over take care of it, you know, overly try to control it through like overly exercising or overly doing it. That's why less is best, guys. <laughs> less is best. And get rid of stuff that no longer serves your highest well-being or your highest wellness. You know, if it doesn't bring you peace, then it needs to go, you know. And um, it starts with regulating yourself. It starts with getting rid of and sacrificing a lot of things. It's sacrifice, guys. Sacrificing habits. Sacrificing um, addiction. Sacrificing... Um, I don't know, a lot of just, just stuff, just stuff in general that <laughs> no longer like helps you, to, helps you become like your more authentic self. I know, I'm so sorry, I'm stumbling for my words, I think, I don't know, it's just, like too much, too much information trying to come through too fast, you know, but um, yeah, just take a look, food for thought, take a look at your environment. If it's cluttered, you know, that means you're probably confused mentally. You know, there's just too much stuff. There's not enough clarity. There's not enough balance. There's not enough um, peace, regulation, you know. And so it's like displayed in your home. You know, it's also displayed in your home, in this home, in this home here, this home, <laughs> this body. <laughs> um, yeah. For me, less is more, less is best. You know, that's why I've cut down on a lot of things. I've sacrificed a lot of things, thoughts, um, belief systems, perceptions. I mean, it goes from like the most densest level of existence to the most subtlest, you know? So from a dense perspective, you can look at this, you know, material things, mater material things, you know? I am eventually going to stop this. I know this is something that I, I need to stop. But I'm going to, I'm not going to pressure myself. I'm going to allow it to organically happen. It's, that's the thing. When I feel like you put unnecessary pressure on yourself to almost like force the change or transformation, um, it kind of like backfires on you because it's like you're forcing change prematurely, you know, before it's supposed to happen. So that's why it's just like, just let everything be, let everything go, less is best, and I don't know about you guys, but ever since I've been, like, just getting rid of so many stuff, I just feel, like, unending peace and clarity and joy in most of my moments. <laughs> Anyways, if you learned something from this video, cool. If you took something away from this video, cool. <laughs> Um, thank you for stopping by and blessings to one and all. Oh yeah, this also, um, I want to say extends out to like the kind of people you surround yourself with, you know? Currently for me, it's just like I spend most of my time with myself and the most high. And it's amazing. <laughs> Anyways, blessings to one and all. Amen.